as high school is coming to an end for us and a new journey is about to begin, it is time for us to sit back and reflect on the past four years. There have been many good and bad times throughout the years with many memories and lessons to learn along the way. I learned a few things about myself and life throughout these years. One thing I learned about is individuality. Growing up as a twin, Co and I were always seen as a pair. We were always together, we played the same sports, and we had the same friends, so it was easy to see us as that duo. But as we began to grow older, we both craved that individuality. We craved to be one of our own. It wasn't easy, but we did it. And as we've gotten older, we still managed to stay somewhat close with each other. Not only as a twin was it hard for me to be myself without others always comparing the two of us, but having to deal with the pressure of fitting in in high school. I learned that you don't have to fit in to have friends. That you don't have to be one of the cool kids. You can be cool in your own way. That you can be yourself and you're going to have true friends who accept you as who you are. Being who you want to be and not trying to fit in with everyone else will make you happy. With being myself, I also found happiness. Even though I believe the quote, happiness is only real when shared, high school taught me that you shouldn't have to worry about pleasing others to make yourself happy. That you can make yourself happy on your own. You live your life for yourself and not for others. So do whatever you can to make yourself happy and you'll be happy. Don't always worry about others' opinions or how they're seeing you. Worry about yourself. Another thing I learned throughout the years is that if you want something, you have to work for it. Playing on Butler's softball team has helped me realize that, as I had coaches and all the players on the team push me to become who I am now. This team taught me that if you want something, you got to go out and get it. You can't go through life expecting things handed to you. You have to work hard and then you'll see the results you want to see. Lastly, I learned that family is all you need. So many friends have come and gone throughout the years. It's just what happens. But then you realize your family is always going to be there for you. I'm glad over the past couple of years, my family has been there for me and that I have had a few close friends that are like family to me. I'd be lost without them by my side, and I'm thankful that I have them. As I close this last lecture, I want you to know that it's okay to be yourself, that you deserve to be happy, and that never let your family go, because in the end, they're all you got.